Hello boys and girls, my name is Sticky and welcome to another exciting episode of I Am A Work Of Art. This week we meet two brothers who express themselves through traditional Zulu dancing. Want to find out who it is? Come along guys, let's go meet them. I'm 14 years old and I'm a student. 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 i I said, I got to tell a bolo of water, got to do love of water, relative of water, everything we do in our work. The Sadilitium was started like 2012. My grandson is dancing, the drama sometimes like Peter or Grumilink, Kenny, Pai Pai Mek. Can I have a study some Since then, but some are practice and they have got about clothes born. Okasaba Arohans. Renata Zulu dance, ya. Yeah. Or eh, a to something like fight scene, na muhuwe. Ya. Na rujin sa ki malumpi tang biola. Na Zulu dance, since ro wana wana wey ro stick dey tell perform na rata ro ko join. Na ro wala la Zulu dance. Na ro ti le di step te ba di tang. Enene di lim jevo ba ubina. I got a Zulu dance, we had big spinning, we were a hammer. We were not telling the animal, animal freeze. Telling the giddy, telling the body with a kicking and clashing. I have a tabu kicking about a baratana too much. Guru Connor, the Sedu Connor, but that's Yamo and Gomu Hulum Gramm was all Tiam, a little sort of tasso, a little sort of tasso. I call it to the valley too, but to me, who shall buy the drama, who to me, Siamo Pili, I shall buy the drama, the city adjoined Siamo, Gabavana Valley too, and a Kitabel and Tubayeta. The Zulu tribe has many rituals that have been passed from generation to generation over time. Dancing is one of the most common types of Zulu rituals and it is part of most Zulu ceremonies, like weddings. Zulu dancing is a sign of happiness, and they happen when any important event takes place. I like to go TV and I go stay here. So I like, I, I like it because my uncle teach up on the So I decided to join. I want to go to the school. 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 We are now going to the state theater to meet Tiamo and Lesedi's uncle, who has taught them a lot about Zulu dancing, and he has played a huge role in making sure that the boys take their talent seriously. Let's see where it all began. Pai Pai Kenny Mekwa uh, from Mamilodi, uh, artistic director, choreographer, uh, director for Pai Pai Creative Arts, and Usutu Arts Production. Today, I am a teacher of the Gambut Dance. Come on, 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 come
So they saw me playing drums and then they get influenced with the, the drums. So they will take those packets and then play, play, play music and then the other one will dance. And then so I saw the, uh, the influence. So that is why I took them. They don't do only uh, African dance. They just watch videos, Michael Jackson videos, and then they imitate. And then so I, I see art. It's where I, I say, Peter, can you push these guys so that they can do dance because they've got passion in the dance. It was very much important for me just to give young people because uh, to grow up with that African, African, African dance. So when you start them uh, uh, when they're young, it's better that way. And then they grew up with that uh, uh, African dance. Yeah, it, that, that was the aim, like to, to start with young people because most of the time when you teach like older, older ones, they will tell you like, uh, they don't see necessity for, for doing African dance. So they just see like, why I do this? But young people, they will get involved, they will love it, and then they will push it until, uh, 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 until, until they'll grow up with that, that, that African dance. I wish, but I feel like I'm going to be a little bit. I don't know if I'm going to be a little bit. I grow old, but I don't know if I'm going to be after the break, we will go and meet their teacher and learn more about this interesting art form. Stay tuned, boys and girls. You don't want to miss this. Welcome back, friends. We are now heading to Tiamo and Lesedi's practice session with their teacher, Peter. Come along. My name is Peter. I'm from Mamelodi West in Pretoria. I'm a dancer. And basically what I do, I teach traditional dance to young kids here in Mamelodi, just to keep them busy. Bend your knees. You're gonna roll down, eight counts. Come up, eight. Side, come up. The other side, four and two. I started teaching Tiamo and Lisedi, uh, I think, 2012. That's when they started joining my group. That's when I decided to form a group for the young 2012 until now. I Peter because They, they were older guys. One of them is Kenny. Uh, he's the uncle of Lesedi and Tiamo. You know, they used to dance all the time, and I, I, I used to come here and I'd be like, you know, I see myself doing that. I used to love it. So I used to sit at the back while they, they were rehearsing. And then I, I love it. And then he, he, he started a group of young guys because we came here as a group to watch them. And then basically, that's where I started.
there are so many different types of Zulu dance, but the ones that I'm teaching them is Umzanzi, as you saw them at training, and then Senzanum Zingeli, Sishayan and Zamu, and there's the other one, hunting dance, we call it Folu. So they know four different types of Zulu dances, yeah. There are many types of Zulu dances. The Ingoma dance is considered one of the most purest forms of Zulu dance and is performed to a chant during big ceremonies. The Indlamu, which is the dance that Tiamo and Lesedi are doing, is the traditional male warrior dance and it shows off masculine strength and mock fighting. While the Ingoma dance is frantically danced and incorporates high kicking motions, Indlamu dance uses drums and whistles. Utsiamo and Olisedi, like technically speaking, they are really good at what they do. They are quick learners, so they, they can adapt to any movement that I teach them. I think Konamanji, uh, what they need is exposure for people to, to get to know them. I think a lot of choreographers would love to work Nabo. And then if they can get uh, yeah, exposed more to, to, to this, this thing, not just Izulu dance, because they can do any type of dance they want to. Five, six, seven, eight. Go, back. Go, 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 Let's find out from the boys what are some of their challenges when it comes to dancing. Challenge dating country and as you dance, you roll a big spin and then you roll. So next time you roll a big spin and then you roll. So next time you roll a big spin and then you roll. The challenge is that as you dance, you roll a big spin and then you roll. You roll a big spin and then you roll. You roll a big spin and then you roll a big spin. I would like to see Utiamo and Elisei as professional dancers, you know. And Funubabona doing big shows, Nama professionals. I want to see them on TV. And I also would like to see them as teachers, Navo, teaching other kids as well, so that the generation now, like, if it's it should go on and on and on because Nyaibona is potential, and I think they're capable of doing that. I would like to see them performing Nami internationally, you know, because I recently came back from Australia. I was doing Nama shows there. So I would love to, to tour with them and then. Now, Babo Nubuti, uh, dance is very important and they can take it and use it as a career, unlike a hobby for now, you know? Wow, the boys are working really hard to perfect their skills and are passionate about what they do. After the ad break, we get to meet a professional Zulu dancer who has been all over the world. Don't go anywhere, boys and girls. We will be right back. Welcome back, friends. You are still tuned in to I Am A Work of Art. We are now going to meet Jerry Zwane, who will be Tiamo and Lesedi's mentor for today. Hopefully, they will get to learn a thing or two from him. Let's go check it out. My name is Sherry Zwane, and I am uh, a creative uh, director, uh, also a creative choreographer, who Tuxedo Arts Productions. Jerry is a choreographer and art director at the Tuxedo Production, which started in 2003 to nurture and restore hope to young people. He has performed in many countries like Spain and France. He has been involved in productions like Warza Albert and has worked with other directors like Mbongeni Ngema. He is now a role model and mentor to school kids and individual artists, assisting them with life and leadership skills, choreography, directing, and project management. He's 
say at the end of the way, like you know, our competitions are money, you know. Yeah, we've been going to competitions where, you know, uh, in Europe, we've been going to competition that my communities wait. So currently, see, we have about 400 Yama trophies. That's why we now go to competitions, while locally and internationally. And it happened in 2013, uh, the CAA Europe, uh, Croatia. Uh, out of 4,000 groups, 4,000 groups, and I think it was 52 uh, countries, we obtained the position one. Welcome to the Tuxedo rehearsal room. So in things like that, I'm born and I'm going to go to Then we take it from there and it's perfect. I was like, I'm going to say it again. This is a little bit nice. Because there are things that are but in the again, be aggressive. Remember, I'm going to see you and I'm going to be You know, like my wheel, like a boy, a boy, and I was with 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 a Yes, because I'm a warrior. I met these young boys in Amtange, of which I'm going to help them, but I'm going to help them, and I'm going to because I'm from a group in 2003, but I'm 15, 16, 17, and I'm So, So, I'm happy to be able to be free to be able 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 to be generation match. You never start to see generation at all. In Jalo, we are going to go to the Siapam. 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 We China one, two, three, four. Okay, yes. Now that's nice. Yes, we are to Yes, we are going 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 to but my friend said, Pegay, it's something as a civism commas. Have a civism commas, yes, you are one commod because it's young and say, I'm for Yonkey, Zonkey's easy, you know. No more about Mutom was a Moza on server, was of Chella Guti, the Puma, the other day, and it. So, now send that twenty years and actually now dance and it. Go to a young Zangonis and the old guidance at Kumbu, and it of it. Sha, good by the simple, er, is what you Yes. 
Five man, 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 five 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 man, so, and by the in a short space of time. I was with my respect. I was respectable on a gun. Because <laughs> Yes, 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 yes. Yes, I'm impressed. I'm good to serve as an alliance. I years only one day, you want to eat that. Season figure is cutting out, and it's perfect. But in Jabela, at least, he's cutting out the 70s, and he's Okay? Nice one. Let's find out from Tiamu and Lisedi how their session was with Jerry and if they were happy to meet him. Today, Rumoa Katahong Art Center, the Copanla Ujer, Rutile Ada Dentis, the Colin Gomas. Can Natiamo Megua, can Nelson Megua, and Razulu Dance? We are work of art. That's all we have time for in today's episode, friends. I hope everyone at home has enjoyed our time together. Join us again next week on our final episode when we look back at all the amazing boys and girls who have blown us all away with their amazing talents. Bye-bye for now.